I convey my deep respect to Jagadguru Shami Isha and his trust, uh, Isha Visha Pragana Trust. Esteemed colleagues and dear friends, it is an honor to be here today at this prestigious academic conclave. I stand before you as the Vice Chancellor of University of Calcutta, an institution steeped the history, a cuddle of countless brilliant minds. From Rabindranath Tagore, the Nobel laureate who was one of the teachers of University of Calcutta, to Shottendranath Bosch, <coughs> the physicist who laid the foundation of Bosch Einstein statistics. Our university has produced luminaries who have shaped the course of human history. As we gather here today, I am filled with a sense of optimism and a deep commitment, commitment to the transformative power of education. In a world that is rapidly changing, education remains the counterstone of progress, innovation and social justice. As we navigate the complexity of 21st centuries, century, the role of education becomes increasingly critical. It is not merely about imparting knowledge, it is about cultivating mind, minds, nurturing hearts and inspiring souls. Let us focus on some topics of education and other aspects of life. First, link between education and nutrition. As a researcher in the field of nutrition, I have witnessed firsthand the profound impact of malnutrition on co cognitive development and academic achievement. A well nourished mind is a powerful mind. You are what you eat holds true, not just for physical health, but also for mental activity. My investigating, my investing the nutrition, by investing the nutrition programs, particularly for young children and pregnant women, we can lay the foundation for a healthier, more educated and more prosperous society. The power of early child childhood education. Early childhood education is a powerful tool for shaping a child's future. Research has shown that high quality early childhood programs can lead to significant improvements in cognitive, social and emotional development. In India, the Integrated Child Development Services, that means ICDS program, has made significant role in providing early childhood care and education to millions of children. However, there is still a need to expand access to quality, uh, quality early childhood education, especially in rural areas. The power of holistic education. A good education has the power to uplift individuals, families and entire community. It can break the cycle of poverty, empower marginalized groups, a drive economic growth. When people are educated, they are better equipped with equipped to make informed decisions, solve problems and contribute to society. The National Education Policy 2020, that is NEP 2020, has laid out a comprehensive vision of Indian education. I em it emphasizes the importance of holistic development and also in cognitive, social, emotional and ethical dimensions. This approach is not merely a theoretical construct but a practical necessity in today's interconnected world. Consider, for example, the case of Finland, a country consistently ranked 
among the top performers in global, global education. Finnish schools prioritize creativity, critical thinking, and problem solving skills. They emphasize experiential learning, project based learning, and use of technology to enhance the learning experience. We must strive to create learning environments that encourage curiosity, critical thinking, and pro problem solving skills. Experimental learning, project based learning, and the use of technology can enhance the learning experience and make education more engaging and relevant. Educating the underprivileged. Next part. Education is a powerful tool for social mobility. By providing quality education to all, regardless their socio-economic background, we can break the cycle of poverty and inequality. The story of Kalpana Chawla, an Indian-American astronaut, is a testament to the power of education to transform lives. Born into a humble family in Haryana, he overcame numerous challenges to achieve her dream. Her journey inspires us all to strive for excellence, no matter for circumstances. Nurturing 21st century skills. To succeed in the 21st century, students need a diverse range of skills, including critical thinking, problem solving, creativity, collaboration, and digital literacy. These skills are essential for lifelong learning and career success. Bridging the digital divide. The, the digital revolution has transformed the way we live, work, and learn. However, the digital divide continues to persist with many students, particularly those from marginalized communities, lacking access, of access to technology and digital literacy skill. To address these challenges, we must invest in digital infrastructure, provide affordable internal access, and train teachers to effectively integrate technology in the classroom. The role of teachers. Teachers are the architects of the future. They play a crucial role in shaping the minds of the next generation. By investing in teachers training and professional development, we can empower them to deliver high quality education. Let us honor the selfless dedication of our teachers who often work tirelessly, often under challenging conditions, and to inspire and educate our youth. Conclusion Throughout history, great thinkers and educators have pondered the nature of learning and the purpose of education. From the ancient Greek to the Indian sages, a common thread emerges, the importance of balanced education and natures both the mind and the heart. Tegot's Shantiniketan provides a compelling example of the educational institute that prioritized creativity, critical thinking and a deep connection to nature. Sonam Wang Chu's innovative schools in Ladakh demonstrate the power of education to address local changes and empower marginalized community. India's recent success in chase is a testament to the power of education, particularly in nurturing young talent. By investing the chase training programs and, the pro and providing opportunities for our young, young players to complete at the highest level, India has produced a generation of world-class chess players. The country's victory in the 2024 Chess Olympiad is a proud moment of India, showcasing the potential of our youth. In conclusion, 
the future of education is bright but requires bold and innovative thinking by embracing the principles of holistic development early childhood education digital literacy and the teacher empowerment we can create a world where every child has the opportunity to reach their full potential let us work together to build a future where education is a powerful force for good thank you so much